Hi YouTube, we're installing a uh, 220 <clears throat> outlet in the garage for um, EVs and plug-in hybrids. And uh, so we need to add a 50 amp circuit breaker to a full box. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I've got a 40 amp here that takes up two slots for one of the air conditioning units. And then down at the bottom, I've got another 40 amp that takes up two slots for the second air conditioner. You have two zone air conditioning. So what I bought was this dual um, 40 amp and uh, they tie the two middles together and the two outers together. So you can get two 40s in uh, one package. So if I take this one out and put this one in, I can wire this one and this one both into this one. And that'll free up this slot here. And I have a 50 amp breaker that I bought that I can put down here. If I ever needed to add another 15 or 20 amp circuit, I could do the same thing, get a 50 on one and then a 15 or 20 in the middle but i didn't need that now so uh this this 50 amp was only about 11 dollars where the dual ones are about 40 or 50 dollars so uh i'm gonna go ahead and do that there's no point in showing you how i ran the wire because that's going to be unique for each different situation it was a hundred foot run from one side of the house to the other. So it was a interesting challenge fishing that wire, but I was able to do it. And uh, step one is getting these breakers installed. So the first thing to do is to shut them both off. And uh, the reason I'm mounting the 240s up here is uh, this wire is gonna be long enough to hit up here, but this wire is not long enough to go down here. So I'll put the 240s up here, I'll put the 50 down here, and then when I put the new six gauge wire in, it can come down and go right into that 50. Because I have plenty of length on the, on the new wire run. So both of these come off, I'll undo these wires. <clears throat> and Put the new double 40 here and wire it up pretty straightforward this was my father's screwdriver for doing electrical work he uh used to wrap electrical tape around this it was getting pretty ratty so i just put new electrical tape on it i guess it protects you from uh shorting out just in case uh, even though this is off it's not hot but you know working an electrical panel you have to be very careful so uh, again, I'm gonna remove these two wires, these two wires, pull these two fuses out, put the new double up here, and then run the wires back in. And here we are on the garage side. I spent the better part of yesterday fishing this line from one end of the house to the other through a finished basement. That was a unique challenge, but we've got the number six wire um, coming out of the wall here. I'll uh, put this box in and wire it up to this 14 50 NEMA outlet. And uh, then the other, other part is to uh, bring the wire down to the electrical box and hook it up to that new 50 amp circuit breaker. Okay, we got the wire brought into the box. And uh, what I will do is uh, strip the <laughs> sorry strip the sheathing off right here, and uh, bring this down, around, over, and up into the new 50 amp CB. Okay, job complete. Got our red, our black. We got the white and the ground up on the. Bus bar, wires come around, go up. Only thing left is to put the cover on 
and we're done. Cover on. Job complete. Thanks for watching.